Right everyone, well I'm glad we're here. I thought I'd do a quick video on one of these old um, shake torches, Faraday torches, or um, well there's quite a few names for them. This is the Everlight Mobile. Now this ain't going to be a proper review because to be honest I've had this torch for so long I don't know how much it costs, I don't know where to buy it from now. Well obviously you could search it and you know find out but I just thought I'd talk about it because for what this is I think this is a really good torch and what I reckon it should be used for. The two main things I would say you want this for is emergencies in your house and bug out bag. Now I have this in my bug out bag which is in my house anyway so but um if you don't know basically you shake the torch up and after a couple of minutes shaking it will stay on for about five minutes. Can't really see how good it is in here. And I have done some footage but you it's hard to show on camera like, it doesn't look very bright but um in actual proper darkness and with your human eyes this is good you know it makes a lot of difference anyway and it's a lot better than nothing uh and they reckon after a couple of minutes it's supposed well supposedly 30 seconds of vigorous shaking will give you five minutes of light but after a couple of minutes it will dim so what some people say is, after a couple of minutes, just give it another 30 second shake and then that should be, um, you know, or even 10 second shake, should bring it back to its full potential. So I'll tell you what now, I'll show you some footage in here and outside. So that was the footage. I don't really know what it looks like. Um, it's hard to say, you know, what it's coming across like on video. Uh, but um, I would say highly recommended. I think when I bought this one, it was about 10, 15 quid. Uh, you're never ever going to need to buy batteries for it. Don't take long to charge. Let's just look at the size quickly. The size is approximately 18 centimetres, which is what's that in inches? It's about seven inches. Weighs less than a standard torch, a lot less, because it's got no batteries in it. This one has got a single old style LED. Well, I think now they do ones with the better LEDs. I'm not 100% sure, but I'd, ass I'd assume by now they probably do. The Cree LEDs, and they also do one where you twist twist it. I don't know if you twist it just like that, if you know what I mean, or just keep going round. You know I mean? One advantage I would say over this, over a wind-up torch, or wind-up torches I've had anyway, nearly all the wind-up torches I've had have always broken. The handles broke. You know, unless you get real proper decent expensive ones, a lot of them aren't that good. Whereas this, proper hard plastic, it's waterproof as well, shockproof. You're not 
going to break this. There's nothing to break. Shaking it. You know. There's nothing, there's nothing to break. Whereas then you're winding. I noticed with all the wind up tools I've had. Eventually the handle would break off. Or something inside would break. So the handle would just spin. It would do nothing. So yeah. I would recommend that. For a bug out bag. Or emergency kit indoors. Uh, this is, like I said, this is the old version. They do an even newer version now, you know. But yeah, I would recommend it for a bug out bag, or even just carrying with you. You know, it's a decent size. Yes, yeah, so there it is. Everlight Mobile. Just search Everlight. Um, linear induction torch, Faraday flashlight, or Shake flashlight. Um, Watch out for counterfeits though, supposedly you can get counterfeit ones that actually, all of the stuff inside is fake and it has a little button battery, but supposedly they're hidden in plain sight, so if you look carefully enough you'll see the battery and you'll know that it's no good, but um, yeah, pay a little bit extra for the genuine ones, and uh, this, you know, it's going to last forever, so yeah, highly recommend it I would say. Right, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you like this video, don't forget to subscribe. Check out my blog. Link will be down there. If you like my channel, you'll like the blog. And, um, yeah, that's basically it. I hope you enjoyed the video.